reading this, aren't you? No. Of course not. I, uh, I did some research. I made a few notes. So, my little encyclopedia, what exactly is sourdough? Well, it's a type of bread that doesn't use yeast as a leavening agent. These miners have agents? Mm, I don't think so. Look at them. Isn't it nice to see the guys helping with the dishes? Now, Colin, did you know to make sourdough bread you need a chunk of what's called starter or mother dough? Wouldn't you need mother dough and father dough? No, just mother dough. These guys here used to carry a chunk of it with them in their bedroll to keep it from talking rough. They would take the dough, put it on a stick, and cook it over the hair pot. Isn't it true they used to strain their coffee grounds through a sock? <laughs> this is the Bodine family. And this is Isidore Bodine. Bonjour. He's the one who perfected the sourdough starter. Tastes perfected to me. Yeah. By the way, did you know they are still using the same sourdough starter that Isidore mixed here 150 years ago? Excuse me? You must have made an awful lot of it. <laughs> you see, you have to save a little bit of the starter dough to mix with the next day's batch of flour and water to keep the fermentation process going. Hey, did you know that the strain of bacteria found in mother dough is active? Lactobacillus San Francisco. How did you know that? Internet. Mm. Hey, can we watch you bake something? Oddly enough, that's what we're here for. Great. You people go on ahead. I'm going to meet you in there. Colin, you stay here and make sure there are no stragglers, okay? Okay. All right. All right, just for kind of a red line to my mind. where you can see me on one of the streets. Come on, Kyle, they can find their way, okay? It's not the California Trail. We lost a couple of the coyotes along the way. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, well, what are you doing? Yeah. This is the bakery. That should be obvious to everyone. Oh, Even oh, to... What I found. What's that? Oh, oh and then I have one for you. Is it me? I'm ready to start making. What do we do first? Okay. First you get a hunk of the mother dough and mix it with flour and a little salt and water and that's it. Voila, the entire list of ingredients. Alright. Here's some dough. Mm -hmm. Let's bake it. Oh, not so fast. From start to finish it takes bakers about 72 hours to make a loaf of sourdough bread. 72 hours? Yeah. Yeah, what's your hurry? What's your hurry? <laughs> Relax and all the roses. Okay, so what's next? Well, you know, bakers actually think of dough as a living thing. So after it's been beaten up and kneaded by the mixer, it needs to sort of relax and calm down. Seems pretty relaxed to me. Yeah. In fact, almost catatonic. Right. I internalize all my tension. <laughs> well, what happens then? Well, then we drop it into that funnel over there, above the divider. The divider cuts it into nice, even pieces. So for this, it has to be relaxed? Yeah. Okay, fine. Oh, what happens then when it goes down that conveyor belt? Well, it goes into the rounder. Do you know what the rounder does? Oh, um, makes it into squares? No. Tetra No. Polygons? Is that your final answer? Okay, so now the dough is round. Yes. Then? Then we have my favorite machine, the overhead intermediate proofer. Wow, it's like a little Disney ride for bread. Attention, please keep your little buttons in the vehicle at all times. <laughs> The device rolls the dough over and over from basket to basket, takes it on a little trip, letting it, once again, relax. This is the most laid-back bread on earth. Come on, Rose, you're teasing me. Can we bake it? No, not yet. Next, the bakers lay the dough on screens and put the screens into oven racks. Then we bake it. Not yet. You'll have to go around the corner to the next window to find out more, okay? And uh, you go on ahead. I'll stay here and get the stragglers. Can okay, you stay with the nice lady? All right. All right. Everyone, follow me. Follow him, everybody. And you, you relax, okay? Okay. Come on. Okay, where were we? We were getting ready to mix some bread. 
No, we weren't. Were you trying to confuse me? Let me think. I remember the racks of dough. The racks of dough are taken upstairs to a refrigerated fermentation room. Refrigerated? Yes. Look, I know a thing or two about baking bread. Well, actually I don't, but I'm pretty sure you have to have heat to bake something, right? Sounds right to me. For a technical question like that, I'm going to have to call in an expert. I'd like you to meet my friend, Tony the Baker. Tony! Hi! Hi. I'm going to enjoy your business. Oh, we're having a great time, we really are. But I'm afraid I have reached my limit of baking knowledge. Tony, call him here. Give us the load. Don't you think we've coddled this dough long enough? Isn't it time to turn up the heat on this baby? Well, no. The dough needs time to ferment in a refrigerated, climate control room. Now that gives the bread a better flavor, texture, and color. It takes about 13 to 16 hours. You know, I like American cooked. Then what happens? In the proof box, the dough is slowly brought up to about 95 degrees and 90 percent humidity. Why not just take it to Florida? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so it's baking now, right? Because it's rising. No, it's still fermenting. The dough triples in size now due to the expansion of trapped gases. Hey, listen, we all have trapped gas occasionally. <laughs> well, now the bread is scored, so it won't split what is baked. Oh, so now I'm almost afraid to ask. It's time to bake it, right? Or do we have to take it out to dinner first? Maybe a bit of a rubdown. It's ready to bake. You're kidding. I hear they spin the bread around when they're actually baking. Is that true? That's right. And if this just steam is sprayed on it from time to time, this gives the crust a beautiful reddish golden color. So I'm thinking I probably couldn't do this at home in the toaster oven. No, I don't think so. Listen, Joey, thank you so much. Yes. <laughs> you were superb. I feel enlightened and rich for me. <laughs> My pleasure. Bye. 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 <laughs> You know what? Let us spray you down because I think you could use some of that gold. Yeah, just color. a little of it. Look at that you got. Right there. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to the waiting for a masterpiece of bigger art. What are you doing? Hey, what are you doing? What? That's not yours. And you gave it to me. He didn't look at you. That was ours to share, Colin. No, it was mine. One piece, please. One little piece. A tiny piece. Don't tell him anything. All right, all right, we're right here. Yeah, you see? Don't tell him. He gave him money. Well, you don't even ask. Uh, you want to get into that goodbye?